Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel, The MK Lady. Well, yesterday was a super, super busy day with working and trying to get, figure out the whole car situation and lots of work phone calls and meetings. It was so super busy and I didn't get a chance to do my outfit of the day. So I do have four things that I want to go through with you today. Um, one of them is a mini unboxing and I, I have some surprising news for you at the very end so I hope I don't forget that surprising news because I don't have very long I have to go somewhere but that's surprising news so I'll go ahead and start with my outfit yesterday so yesterday I was just wearing this white sweater with this beautiful off-the-shoulder long movie color dress so remember I also have whoops sorry the beautiful shirt in the mauve color I love this pattern so much and this dress is actually backwards but I love this pattern so much that I got the shirt and I got the dress and so I got them last year at Maurice's and then this little kind of sweater top I got from bootlegger last year as well so the purse of the day yesterday was the Michael Kors Manhattan in pale lilac with the silver tone hardware as you could see right there so just imagine me wearing it <laughs> so this is how I wore it just over the shoulder just like that I got so many compliments I was wearing white my white Michael Kors sandals and it was so easy to grab at the top handles like I'm telling you it is just putting those clothes back there it is a looker now the stud detailing on here doesn't bother me as much because they blend in with the color of the purse now the Grecian blue Manhattan that I had it kind of just like pop 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 all these silver hardware but then I thought you know what these are on sale they're on sale right now and I thought I'm gonna give it another shot but I decided in the pale lilac now it's very structured I did miss the back pocket to put my phone but it's just easy open there is plenty of room to fit your items there is no key fob holder and I'm a little worried of the smooth leather so we'll see how it does over time I'm very careful with it and see because there is so many stud detailing as well as these I'm scared the hardware I hope it doesn't scratch or tarnish but we'll see because I'll be using this for a while anyway so that is the Manhattan pale lilac now I also had a question from one of my subscribers she was wondering about the medium I want to say Gramercy but I don't know Tatiana 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 Th that's I think how you say it and deep fuchsia and uh, the garnet color with the silver tone hardware now she was wondering if it's too small for her item so I said hi Sandra I said that I would do a video and show how much could fit now I didn't have exactly everything you had in the question but I did improvise so let's go ahead and look at everything that I have in there so she said she carries two cell phones so I have the two I have the plus cell phone and the regular cell phone on the middle compartment as you could see right here now she said she carries oh I have a receipt this is okay that's just a bank receipt so she carries a wallet a full-size wallet so I would put that at the front now if you noticed I undid these buckles 
Now in the back, she said she has a travel size Tylenol bottle, but I don't. So I decided to get this hand sanitizer. It is a little longer than a travel size Tylenol bottle, but that fits. And she said she has a Kleenex, um, little Kleenex bag, but I didn't have one of those little Kleenex thing. But this is kind of similar and this is, let's see. Oh, it's a first aid kit. So here's a first aid kit, like the size of Kleenex. And she said she has a card case. So this is just a regular standard card case. And she said her she has her office keys and her work keys. So it does have a key leash and it does have a zip pocket right there. So this stuff all fits in there just nicely and the phones like I said they're in the middle and the wallets right there and we can go ahead and close it up and there you go all those items actually fit so I think it might fit your stuff Sandra uh, that's what I could think of I hope that helps you make the decision but that is the medium Tatiana in the deep fuchsia. So the next item I want to show you, this was my Sephora order from a while ago and it just it got misplaced and shipped to the wrong place. So I only have a few things in there. So I want to go ahead and show you what I ordered and just do a quick, quick unboxing here. So it just comes with your standard receipt, put that there, some packaging. So here is everything, whoops, it's all, it's all falling to the front. So I just got, I love this Born This Way foundation, Too Faced, in the color vanilla, I believe. It is, oh, it feels so good on the skin. I love it, love it. I think it's $51. And then I had some points that I needed to use, so I got this um, See Your Old Glow. So it's just a set, so I used my points for that. And then just some Sephora samples, some Stellar Foundation and Tom Ford. I want to try that. I heard that one's pretty good. And also, I did use... I wanted to see vice lipstick I bought this with my points as well and I wanted to take a quick peek oh it's it's quite a small lipstick so oh oh well it's quite a red color so I'll give that a shot I'm not sure so that is the unboxing for Sephora I can't wait to try all that stuff out so today the outfit of the day I have a few errands I need to go to I'm actually going to look uh, at a used black Selma now you know how much I love my Selmas well they're you can't get them in the retail store only at the outlet and I'm not near an outlet so I'm going to meet this lady to take a look if I actually, if that is what I'm going to buy. She said I could come take a look at it. So that was my surprise. But for the outfit of the day, I just have my white guest shirt on, my black stretchy joggers on, Hilberg and Burke earrings, necklace, and this beauty. This is the Blakely Bucket and Stripe. I'm going with the whole black and white stripe theme again because I bought a new car and it's black and white and I love it. I will do another review on that but hopefully I won't fail at that one. I'm kind of trying to figure out how to do that but I'll go ahead and show you. So this one I made it into the bucket and it does have a long strap. I'm going to keep the long strap on there and then these two handles so I'll go ahead and show you what it looks like on. It is so cute. So as a bucket, this is how it would look as a bucket. I'm not sure if I'm gonna take the strap or not. I mean, I probably might not even need it, but on the crook of my arm, this is how 
the bucket would look. And there you go, the Blakely bucket. It does have a back slip pocket and I guess I should turn up my camera so you could see. So on the inside here, you just pull these down to make it bigger and then you open it right up and it is quite dark in there, but it's black micro suede with one slip pocket and that's all you got in there. So that is the purse of the day, the Michael Kors Blakely bucket. There, now you can see me as well. I should have turned my lights on in the beginning of this video, but that's okay. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe to my channel, The MK Lady. Also, don't forget to hit the notification bell because every time I upload a video, you will get notified. Have a great day. Bye.